to the channel guys. We talk about semen retention primarily, but we also talk about the experience of attractive men and just how to navigate that landscape. So one of the things I've experienced in the past when I did used to um, date when I was looking for a partner was the experience of accidentally ignoring texts and that resulted in resulting in complete um, it completely ended the um, the process the relationship whatever and just by accident you know and this is the thing about being someone who is considered attractive or handsome if you ignore a text whether it's accidentally if you take like a whole week it happened <laughs> I took a whole week to respond, uh, or was it four days to respond? I think I was, I was extremely busy. I took four days to respond, and then I realized, wait a minute, I haven't, re I haven't responded to this person. And I looked at my phone, I responded to them, and then they just sent me like some of the nastiest responses ever. And it makes sense. It's like I remember when I was on the other on the other side of it, like when I was, you know, texting someone and they they would not respond, and I'll feel really bad about myself and feel like damn they must really like be playing games and stuff like that and that's the thing as an attractive guy you can't risk this anymore you literally have to set reminders to text people back because if you miss that text the person is just going to interpret it as you have low interest um they're going to interpret it as you're just playing games and it's just not going to go well at all you're just going to miss opportunities and it's going to be like damn i did i did this accidentally i didn't even mean to do it so, one of the things you can do is just literally have a calendar in your room and write in the calendar, remember to text whoever back or remember to call this person back. Or in my case, just remember, I even send myself texts to say, remember to text this person back. And another thing as well, it's just very simple and logical. It's just Deal with one person at a time is probably the easiest thing to do. Like for me, it's just easy for me to just speak to one person at a time because I won't be thinking that, oh, I won't be having to juggle and just think, okay, I need to text this person, I need to text that person. It's just better psychologically in that sense. And it's just, you just don't risk that um, not texting. But yeah, in general, that is, that's it. That's all I want to talk about. The fact that as an attractive guy, handsome guy, you can't risk um, texting people, uh, missing missing out on texting people because it's going to make them completely aloof. And in fact, one of the biggest regrets of my life, I remember 2018, I went to this uh, place in London, West London, called The Ship. And apparently it's like where a lot of uh, famous people go, uh, made in Chelsea, people are. And I, I didn't know that people like, I went there. Um, until after what I was talking about at work. But I met uh, someone who was a, a model. Uh, she was like a mixed race model there. And I remember, I'm like, what the hell? She's talking to me and, you know, I didn't expect her to speak to me or whatever. We we're speaking, whatever, talking. And then I asked her for a number. She's like, of course. And she gave me a number. And obviously when I went home, I looked at WhatsApp and obviously a picture appeared. So yeah, she was genuine, it was real. And I tried to do this thing, I <laughs> experimented and said, okay, because she's so attractive, because she's so confident with me when she's speaking to me, I need to give it a few days to make it seem like, you know, I'm not too available, I'm not too accessible, and therefore she's, therefore she's going to be more into me. And the complete opposite happened. I took, I think I took about nearly a week to respond to her or to even text her. And then I texted her a week later and then she's like, um, who is this? I don't know who this is. And I, was like, I explained who I was and where we'd met. And then it just silence. Did not respond back. And then I just realized this, this is not a good thing to do ever again. Never again in my life will I play this game of trying to not text back to create value in myself. So if you're an average guy or guy who's below average, you can probably do that because it'll probably create a sense of value in terms of how the person perceives you. But once you become an attractive guy, handsome guy, too risky. 
in my opinion, in my experience as well. Anyway, what are your thoughts on this? I'd love to know what you experience with this. And yeah, that's it, guys. Thank you.